Time to roll up a sleeve. Today is World Blood Donor Day. It's a day for raising awareness about the need for blood donations and to thank donors. Now, here are some numbers that may motivate you to start or keep on giving. Somebody needs blood in the U.S. every two seconds, but only 2% of Americans are blood donors. So, joining us now is Victoria Wolf. She is with a nonprofit blood services provider, Vitalant. Victoria, we appreciate your time today. Let's talk about California's blood supply situation right now. Are we still seeing this shortage? And what blood type is most in need? We are seeing a blood shortage in California. We're about 13,000 blood products down on uh, April, May compared to last year at this time. So, um, in a critical blood shortage, we're working hard with our hospital partners to manage blood inventory. We need people to schedule appointments and come out to the drives. So all blood donations are needed. You ask what's most needed. Type O is the most common, it's the most uh, requested from our hospital partners. But that said, all blood donations are needed, especially type O and especially platelets. And some people don't know what type of blood they have, but for people who have never donated, what should they expect and who is and is not a good candidate? Well, most people can donate blood. About 60% or so of the population is eligible to donate blood. And like you said, only 2 to 3% actually donate. So if you have any questions about if you think um, you're not eligible to donate blood, please visit our website at vitalant.org and go to the eligibility page. That gives a lot of explanation for that. Um, and you can call us at 877-25-VITAL and you can ask any questions that you may have about your personal questions about eligibility. But most people can donate. It only takes an hour and it's an incredibly wonderful thing to do for another human being. What do you find is the biggest barrier for people to donate? And do you have a message to anybody who's maybe kind of on the fence saying they're not sure if they want to donate? Well, um, the biggest barrier I think at this point is that people are busy and they just gotten out of the house uh, when they've been locked in for the last couple of years due to the pandemic. But um, I would say that giving blood, you give people an opportunity for their future. You give opportunity to a child, you give it to a teenager, you give it to a parent. It's an incredibly wonderful thing to be able to transform a life in this way. And you'll feel really good when you donate. So um, I encourage anybody who's able to donate to please visit us, schedule an appointment and get it. It's only people now who will create and make those appointments that will help us prevent blood shortages like we're having now. All right, it really is the gift of life. All right, Victoria Wolf, thanks for joining us this afternoon. Thank you very much. Appreciate it.